Welcome to Easy English by Eddie Singh and today we are going to explore another uh, value based question based on the lesson the last leaf by O. Henry that is hope sustains life. Well Manish you would uh, like to ask me a question sir what is it hope sustains life what is it? So what is it hope sustains life? Yeah the, the proverb hope sustains life is quite meaningful and relevant to the context of the story the last leaf as we always know that we we have to live a positive life a positivity can make us live it is our hope and desire to live that makes us strong am i right if a person thinks that he can live a life he can survive and he can struggle out he can really live if a person has a negative thought and if he decides that he will not succeed in life he will never succeed so success in life totally depends upon your desire to work in the right direction in this similar way if you are having a strong desire to survive and live no disease can make you die understand this is true in the story the last leaf written by o henry as we see that the girl the young artist you know john c who is sick with pneumonia is now she has made up her mind that she would not survive she has pinned out her destiny to the last leaf hanging on the climber, uh, climber hanging on the climber and the the vine uh, that she is counting every day the falling of the leaf and she has already declared that with the falling of the last leaf on the you know creeper she would die and this is the negativity that has made her suffer a lot and she is not able to recover. The medicine doesn't work because of her negative thought. She has already declared that the, the, and she is counting the leaves falling every day and she is waiting for the last leaf to fall. This, I mean, thought is being changed by her friend, Siu. She makes such a, I mean, observation and discuss with the doctor. The doctor describes everything and she says that uh, unless and until John C has change of mindset, she will not recover because she has already made up her mind uh, to die. She has not decided, she had no desire to live a life. And therefore, she shares this to Beherman, the, I mean, old artist and tells everything about uh, John C. Beherman knew it very well that this girl, this stupid girl, is uh, making her life ruin and therefore he decided to paint the last leaf on the um, creeper. And in the very windy and rainy, I mean night, when it was raining and there was ice cold, I mean weather, Beherman came out of his house, even in high fever, he was also suffering from pneumonia and painted the last leaf. In the next morning when John C got up from her bed and she pulled out the curtain to see the last leaf. It was still clinging on the creeper. Am I right? Having seen the last leaf still clinging on the creeper, she re retained her hope of survival and she jumped with joy and said that she wanted to survive. And that really made her believe that if one has a desire to live, one would certainly live, one cannot die. So it is only John C's hope of survival and desire to live that makes her, I mean, full of hope and desire and recover her very soon. She survives after that, though Beherman, who painted the master, I mean, creation, died because of the pneumonia. He didn't survive, yet he left behind a historic claim that his master painting could save the life of one person that was John C. That was John so C. it is rightly said that hope sustains life. Hope sustains life. Thank you. Okay. Definitely. Uske pahle ho gaya. Uske pahle ab.